don't have to be phony to kick it be you the whole fun house marrying thing is happening showing a true reflection of themselves <laughs> We touch into your mind, body, and soul. So, 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 so. This, this is a homage beat. Y'all know I'm chaos, right? Us, too early decoded. Accompanied by her husband, son, and daughter, Adelia Wilson returns to the beachfront home where she grows up as a child. Haunted by a traumatic experience from the past, Adelia grows increasingly concerned that something bad is going to happen to her family. Her worst fears soon become a reality when four masked strangers descend upon the house, forcing the Wilsons into a fight for survival. When the masks come off, each stranger takes the appearance of a different family member. The trailer starts off with the I Got Five on his song. And we all know that song is talking about weed. The dad, Hannah Man from Black Panther, sings the whole first hook. I got five on it, messing with that in the weed. Then, that bold face lies to his son. Acting fake, acting fake, acting fake, and trying to protect him from something we all know he'll understand sooner or later. Message! So why lie? Why act fake? And as I go through the rest of this trailer to code, you'll see how fake is the new real. The family at the beach knows the Wilson family already. Tying into they've been there before, and something in the time they were there already happened to their family. I'm assuming when the kids were really, really young, as the Caucasian mom says, they're getting so big. Don't be fooled. That other family is there for a reason. Okay, so from the trailer, we see that the Wilson family home gets invaded. The family is invaded by duplicates of themselves, most likely playing out the theme of this movie as they're dealing with their demons or they're just dealing with their worst enemy. The white rabbit symbolizes clones or fake as we all know that there is no such thing as a white rabbit. Basically GMO animal. White rabbits were created in a lab so they can be used as a carbon based being to run experiments on. Y'all know what carbon based beings are. <laughs> Look it up. Toasty. Look up carbon beings and carbon based beings. Just like a white rat white rice or anything dealing with that color it is not real they have one black rabbit in the scene that lets you know that the rabbit is the original organic the true version you don't have to be phony to kick it be you the whole fun house marrying thing is happening showing a true reflection of themselves just a theory mom lupita meets her childhood self as she is the main focal point in the movie description. Seeing herself as a child is representing some kind of childhood trauma that she has to face and overcome. From the looks of things, they were in an insane asylum or some kind of halfway house, showing the significance of how trauma can drive you crazy or the Wilsons acting fake is the real crazy. Also, another theory is that can be their third child and something happened to her. But the dad looks to not be involved with the situation that's unfolding for that to be the case. So basically tying the rabbits in and the whole cloning myth saying stop acting fake. Quit lying to yourself. Yeah, the Instagram pictures are cute, but photoshopping something you're not is whack fake. Be your true organic self. The scissors look like some rabbit ears, but they also are symbolic of cutting out that fake aspect of yourself. Stop, Stop being someone you're, you're not. not. Cut, Cut it, it off. Message. 
Remember, Jordan Peele is an no occultist, so his movies will basically be psychological mind game thrillers. Toasty! Meshing both movies together, I heard people saying, get out of the US, get out of us. But if anything, we could take a teachable moment from this and get out of our own way. Obviously, there's gonna be a twist in the movie. He doesn't seem like the type to just show his hand. So hopefully I'm completely wrong and it can be something us, chaos beings can actually enjoy. Dream wise, 